project and the plan, the management plan for the park uh, involves removing those invasives and restoring a, a variety of native vegetation back to the park. Uh, primarily a mixture of native grasses and wildflowers, but also restoring uh, native shrub cover and also just promoting some of the other native plants that are already viable and present here in the park. While it may seem destructive right now, uh, this is a sort of a, a temporary disturbance that's going to be part of a you know, highly beneficial and long-term improvement. This is native uh, grapevine, possibly either a frost grape or fox grape, and oftentimes you'll find it growing out in these, uh, in these uh, in older fields and oftentimes on fence rows. It actually competes very well with a lot of your invasive species, uh, some of the invasives that we have back here, and is a very beneficial food source for wildlife. This is autumn olive, originally uh, uh, shrub species that came over from Asia and uh, was actually used as a wildlife planting for a long time. You can see a lot of these bright red berries that, uh, that are also edible, um, but uh, uh, it was used to enhance a lot of places in Pennsylvania for wildlife habitat, but since has become very invasive and chokes out a lot of our beneficial species such as grapevine, some of our dogwood species that would normally grow in an area like this. This is Moldaflora rose, uh, yet another invasive species that originated in Asia. It has made, made its way over here into a lot of our old fields, orchards, and forests. Uh, this species, you can see it has a lot of these bright red and orange berries. They stay viable in the soil for about 20 years. It chokes out a lot of our native vegetation that, uh, um, that we like to have for our bird species. Here we have a native shrub species. This is called or gray stem dogwood. And you can see it has uh, uh, kind of some reddish colored stems with these clumps of uh, kind of light green or, or white uh, berries. It's a very important food source for a lot of migrating songbirds. Rough grouse really like to eat it and uh, is also high in fat and nutritional content for migrating songbirds.